Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Isn't it a great day? Yes. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you, Maureen. It's my honor to be here for the 2011 Global Race for the Cure. Today we have 4,242 teams, including 45 teams from Capitol Hill and 33 teams from Embassy. Let's give them a huge hand. This is truly a global race, and that's important because we have a global and growing fight. Across the world, a woman dies of breast cancer every 69 seconds. And breast cancer is the leading cancer killer of women worldwide and many men as well. But breast cancer is a large problem that can be fought with small solutions and it takes interventions at the community level and that is why 75% of the money raised today will stay in this area. And let me tell you about the good it does. Two years ago, a low-income person in this region who feared they had breast cancer had to wait nearly a hundred days before they got a diagnosis. Thanks to the funds from this race alone, it now takes seven days. An early diagnosis means a better chance for survival. And thanks to your help, since our first race for the cure, we have increased the survival rate for breast cancer when caught early to 98%. That's the power of the movement. Too often in this town we see ourselves as Republicans or Democrats. Well today we don't associate ourselves with the colors red or blue. Today my friends we are all pink. And we need that unity to continue after this race because our accomplishments are at risk. The economy is struggling. Budgets are tighter. So we need our elected officials from every party to come together in support of the breast cancer programs that are saving lives. If my sister Susie were here today, she would take joy in the inspiration you provide. She'd take pride that in a divided city, there is unity on this issue. She take comfort in the fact that hopes are high and that a cure is near. And with your continued help, your contributions, your commitment, we will achieve our final victory, a world free of death from breast cancer. Thank you.